we are going to make suppositories. We have suppository base and we have silica gel that will be used as an example of an active ingredient already triturated together properly and sifted. We have our hot plate stir plate, currently uh, 50 degrees centigrade. Uh, Sapazi base melts at the minimum of 40 degrees centigrade, so that's a good temperature to have. We have our suppository molds right here with our stir bar. Everything has been sanitized. And here we go. So you pour your Sapazi base into the beaker. And you set it here to melt. You leave your stir bar out at this point because you want to put that in once this is in, once it's melted. You had to stir it around? No, you allow it to melt. Uh, another technique that you can use to melt this more evenly is the uh, water bath. But we typically don't use that, we just allow it time to melt and it's fine. We also, well, right now we don't have the manual thermometer, but we check the, th the temperature of the melted base to make sure that it doesn't exceed anything that would uh, um, denature the active ingredient or any of the excipients at that. So it's going to take a while to melt. 